Hi everyone, welcome back to Animal Crossing with me, Austin John Plays. That's me, playing this game. And I just now noticed that Isabel has a fan in her room. Probably because it's getting pretty warm out there. Hi, Butterpup. It's been a minute. It has. Listen up, everyone. I... I am burnt out of this game. I really am. I don't really want to play it right now. Like, I have over 600 hours in here, and I grinded so much, it's just rough. And now it's wedding season, and as someone who canceled their wedding, <laughs> I do not have any interest in doing a digital wedding in the one game that's how I escape from reality. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? Great. Uh, but if you want to participate in it, go for it, because Harv is going to call you and tell you to come to his island to help with anniversary photos, uh, which I am not going to do. Not going to do that. However, the one thing that I am interested in is there is some new bugs and fish for us to get. And if you have been following my checklists on Twitter, then this is going to be the final one. Can we can we get that on the screen? real quick here. So as you're gonna see right here, I switched to a year format because there's a good chance you have more than half of them in the game. And essentially what you do is you go through here and I like to mark off all the ones that I have so I'll go through and I'll delete these because I know that I have these for a fact because these were all during March as you can see right here. And then we get to everything that was available in April and everything that was available in May so I know for a fact that I have all of those. And then, you have everything that's brand new in June. All these boys, right here. If you have gone to the Southern Hemisphere, then you may already have some of these. But apparently, we have a whole bunch of sharks available. Which I already have most of them. <laughs> Alright, and since I started recording, I actually found a problem with the bugs page. So, that's now updated, which is awesome. And after I cleared out everything that I already have, so like, this is the system I've been using for a while now. And I see that I only have two fish to catch this month. A size 4 in the river, yay, that's probably, I'm gonna catch so many sea bass, and a size 5 in ponds, the giant snakehead. And one is available now, one is available tonight. Oh, the saddle Bashare. That's the one that we thought we had back in March, but we didn't. And as far as bugs, I have four bugs that I could get this month. The firefly tonight, the mosquito tonight, the goliath beetle tonight, and the drone beetle today. And it's only 200 bells, so I assume it's going to be very common. Ooh, the Goliath Beetle, 8,000. I think that's one of the very rare ones. I'm probably best off going to a destination island for that. Using, using myself an NMT. Know what I mean? Well, fantastic. I now have the checklist, so you have the tools so you can play the game how you want and get all of your completion done. That was fun. And, uh... I mean, honestly, like, now that I'm done talking about that, I don't want to play anymore. I really don't. I'm so burnt out of this game. I mean, I guess I could give you, like, a little update on what I've been up to. I decided that I was going to base my map off of the actual grid. So you can see here, everyone has, like, their own individual grid spaces, which I thought was going to be really cool. I mean, I still think it is cool. I reduced the campsite a little bit. I made the entire middle area of my island, a big old central park, which is neat. And I moved the celestial garden over here in the middle of the central park, along with the bee apiary over here. And just like, I don't know, there, I, I don't really have any ambition playing. I'm sorry, just like, I, I know everyone was enjoying the series, but you know what? If I'm not enjoying it, it's not going to be a good series. You know what I mean? So, I might, you know, regain interest in this at a later point in time. But for now, I'm, I'm pretty much done. Rather than, like, force myself to play this and not make good content, I would rather not play it and maybe get, like, a, a rebirth and wanting to come back to you guys with a nice, fresh mindset. I think that would be a much better option. So, yeah, this was just me making my video telling you about the, the June event, the new June bugs and fish. There's gonna be that linked on my Twitter. I'm probably also gonna put in the description down below the link to my Mediafire page that you can download those docs. 
I know Mediafire sucks, but I used to use Google Docs and people just kept that tab open, which then let me not even edit it. It was a whole mess. So now we're stuck with Mediafire, that hot garbage. I guess this is goodbye for now. And thank you guys for the support on Animal Crossing. It it was it was a great series that helped me distract from the world around us. And now that things are, you know, very slowly starting to open up, I feel like that's going to be great. I, I might, I might work on this from time to time, but for now, I don't know. I'm excited for Pokemon coming out. We're getting the direct tomorrow. I'm excited for the new Paper Mario game. Uh, I've been playing a lot of Minecraft Dungeons. That's a lot of fun. I've been getting back into DJing, something I haven't done since pff, November which I stream live on Twitch. I think I might make it like a every Sunday sort of thing, which should be dope. And yeah, time for me to relax a little bit from Animal Crossing. If you're enjoying other Nintendo IP games, I'm going to be actively doing those. And if you're only around for the Animal Crossing, then it's been a blast. And stay subscribed because we may do some stuff in the future. Till next time, Austin John out.